Holly, and I'm here today to challenge you to do the toilet paper challenge. As you can see, I have five jars filled with the same amount of room temperature water. And I'm going to be placing one item in each jar and swirling it for five seconds, because five seconds is the average time it takes for a toilet bowl to flush. The five things I'm going to be using are toilet paper, flushable wipes, paper towel, facial tissue, and dental floss. These are five common things that are flushed down our toilets. Now for the fun part, seeing if they disintegrate. Because this is not magic. Just because it disappears from your toilet bowl doesn't mean it disintegrates for the sewer system. As you can see, the toilet paper has fully disintegrated and it's very hard to gather anything on the stick. This is what we want to see happen. However, if we go over to the flushable wipe, you can see that it's still fully intact and hasn't disintegrated. It still looks like new. Then, we go to the paper towel and it's still fully intact and has not disintegrated either. Next is the facial tissue. As you can see, it hasn't disintegrated and it's gathered itself like a rope. And this can still cause problems in our sewer system. And finally is the dental floss. It's still fully intact, really strong, and it hasn't disintegrated. As you can see, these four products have not disintegrated and they still look like new. If something doesn't disintegrate like toilet paper, then it's not meant for our sewer system. There are only two things that should be flushed down our toilets. Toilet paper and human waste. Thinking twice before you flush is just a simple way to show that you care for your watershed. This video was brought to you by the Redfish Group Program. Thank you for watching.